This is Captain Art Taylor of Searcher Sport Fishing with another Tackle Tip Thursday. Okay, we've had suggestions and questions about uh, casting lures. When you're um, in an area where there are schools of bluefin tuna on the surface and they're chasing bait, and, and what's the procedure for that? So we're going to drive up and get close to the school and you're going to cast this casting lure. So it's obviously, it's a replica of a bait fish. This one's 150 grams and it's been upgraded. It's got the better hook on it. So that's something that you want to ask your tackle guys about. So you're just replicating a bait fish. You're going to cast this lure out and you're going to let it sink momentarily and you're going to put your reel in gear and you're going to wind as fast as you can. And you're going to repeat that process uh, as the school goes down, maybe you let this lure sink a little bit deeper. And, um, you know, we'll, we'll let you know from the bridge how deep the school is. And so you can let this lure sink down to uh, the depth that we're calling out, on, uh, that we're seeing them on the depth sounder. So you're casting this into the middle of a school of fish that's on the surface and let it sink momentarily and put the reel in gear and you want to wind in as fast as you can because you're trying to replicate a bait fish and that's the the method for using these this would be a current sniper there's there's plenty of um, options with that con uh, is concerned but this is 150 gram there's 100 grams uh, there's some really small ones I guess it would depend on what size bait the fish is is uh, chasing on the surface, but the, the, this can be really, really effective for bluefin tuna casting for schools of fish that are on the surface. What if everybody's getting a bite and I'm not? Well, the first thing would be, you know, talk to your friends and say, hey, what size lure are you using? And maybe you're using 150 gram and they're using a 100 gram lure or vice versa or maybe they're using a specific color. And so maybe you would want to change to that specific color. So if you're not getting a bite and somebody else is, then just go up and ask, hey, what are you using? Or how long are you letting it sink for? Or how fast are you turning the handle for the retrieve? And you can get that info from your fellow anglers. Just pay attention to what they're doing and try and replicate it.